So, he's dead. Hey guys, Exodark1 here, and welcome to a new episode of The Frame Train, where we talk about Yu Gi Oh! Brains, uh, the weekly show. We talk about Yu Gi Oh! Brains, we review it, we talk about what's happened. I talk about it in, in, in sort of a, a, a period of time that is not uh, sort of predetermined. I just do it, I just talk about it. Let's hop onto The Frame Train, let's talk about Yu Gi Oh! 37, turn 37. I know the title. Why don't I sound like Sam Mill from Wakulture? Why? Here's why. So, yeah, it, the episode picks up, the bridge is collapsing, you know, it looks like the duel's gonna end and, and he's gonna beat Playmaker by cheating and essentially beating, you know, by killing him through other means. Playmaker, you know, everything's going to shit. Playmaker, big old smile on his face going, ha 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 
and he's gone. He sacrificed himself. Are you kidding me? Zizen's dead, maybe. He might not be dead. He's got a virus. So does that mean he's now got the same virus and he's now dead? Or has he just joined the data like Aoi? He probably won't. I don't, they better not kill him off. They bet, I hope once it's all sorted, he does come back and he will back and that'd be great. I hope so. Because I like Zizen. He, I like him. So don't kill him. Yusuke does that whole, you know that thing in anime where like you can't see their eyes, so they're clearly angry. You know what I mean? <laughs> His hair's all in the way, you know, you can't see his eyes, and then eventually he gives you the crazy eyes, and he's just like, mm, and the crazy eyes go off, and he's like, right, it's time to go off, it's what he says, he doesn't say that, can you imagine, <laughs> time to go off, spectre prick, so, he goes off, he summons all, does all these new moves, bish bash bosh, gets in code, talk back, absolutely destroys spectre, and, you know, Spectre's like, oh, I can't believe you played me. I can't believe you used my loyalty to Revolver against me. Can't believe. Can't believe this happened. He's all upset, starts laughing, turns around, and his mother tree is on fire. His mother... The tree's on fire, guys. Like, the duel's over, so rather than the hologram just disappearing... The tree sets on fire and he starts to cry. Why would it set on fire? Is it just because it's dramatic, I guess? Set, the tree sets on fire and the duel's over. Don't kick a man while he's down. He loves that tree. I hate that tree. But the, the fact he turns around and this tree that he considers his mother's, that's essentially he's watching his mother burn alive. I mean, that's twisted. That's twisted. I loved it. Twisted, though. So, he disappears, Playmaker starts running for the, running across the bridge, continue on his mission, the bridge starts caving away, gives away, and the last shot is of him, and, and Aiden's falling like that, it's freeze frame, and the episode's over. This was an okay duel, I mean, I mean, it was just, it's meh, it's just, it's, I think it's because we've seen the whole hostage thing before in Kaiba when he did it to himself and uh, I don't know it's just the show's still not grabbed me yet you know a few couple of few episodes ago I talked about how I was watching Oli Monogatari and that gripped me first episode I'm watching an, episode, an anime on Netflix Violet Evergarden that's gripped me Seraph of the End that's gripped me, and it's you know only a couple of episodes in. We're thirty-seven episodes in, and there are characters I like, but honestly, it's gone to that point where I'm only real. I'm at, I'm at that point where I still love Yu-Gi-Oh and I do love Yu-Gi-Oh, but I'm watching the show mainly for this, and I, I'm going to keep reviewing the series because I want it to pick up. I want it to get better, but we're thirty-seven episodes in, and I'm still I'm not that invested in it. I'm like. Well, I know Playmaker's going to win this duel. I mean, it's a question of how he's going to win, I guess. But I don't care. But I just get to revolve. I want it. That's what I want. I want that duel. Ghost still gone. I don't know where he is. Again, if he appeared in the previews, I didn't. I don't watch the previews, as you may know. So I don't know where it goes in the next episode. We'll just have to wait and find out. But honestly, it's again, it's it's not stale, but it's just like. I don't know, it's just like, it's like, it's like eating a, a, a plain ham sandwich. I mean, it's nourishing, and there's a bit of flavour with that ham, but you wouldn't want a ham sandwich every single day, you know what I mean? You're getting the same ham sandwich, you want to throw a bit of, you want to throw some cheese on that, put some, mix it up, not even have ham, have cheese, have, have beef, have chicken. You don't want the same processed ham sandwich every day. That's what you get your friends at the moment, it's just, it's the same processed ham sandwich and i don't want that i want i want more and and i think we need to you know it can be better it really can be better and i, I think we're, we're we need to wait for that to happen anyway guys that's all i've got time for today thanks for joining uh don't forget we do have a patreon so if you want to be a dark tron where you commit to the show you can help with things like um you know getting better uh, equipment for the recordings better sound equipment lighting lighting equipment you know i'm gonna i've updated the um 
I've updated the Patreon with new uh, new rewards, new goals. For example, hiring out a space so I can actually have a proper studio to do all this in. So if you like this show and you like the channel, and you want to support the channel, please go to the Darktron and check it out. We've got some good got some good stuff over there. I'd like to thank my my current Darktrons. Their names will pop up at the end of the show. Because you make it all, you know, you're helping me out. Even if it's just a little bit, you help out in more ways than you than you realise. So, thank you very much. I'll see you all next time, guys. Bye-bye. <laughs>